Alright, greetings guys. Welcome back to Wipeout and Plays. We've got our Void. We've got to take two of these bosses out, and then we take out the big boy in the middle. Um, what have we got? During the Void fight, each time you purge a card, block two. Not bad. Every third turn, gain 125% rate. Not bad either. Void touched will spawn with 40% damage suffered. And from turn 6 onwards during the Void fight, start each turn with Rage 75%. Now, we can only set 2 of these, I think. Well, having 125, I think 75%, oh, that's on turn 6 onwards. What if we don't release the souls? Like, that's doing a lot of damage. All right, let's take our, let's gain a little bit of block each turn. Has ability to clear debuffs, okay, and gain high amounts of fortitude. The minions can constantly apply poison when they aren't keeping their queen safe. Okay. Now, we've got to remember everything we're doing. We are using this at some point pretty quick. This will give us block. Which will be useful. Um, but we'll do this first, I think. Number of flipping cards in your discard pile and gain two banes you discard. Alright. Get rid of that, get rid of that, and then get rid of. That's not bad, but. Not the best on the start, because we don't need the block. But Sift 3 is good. Discard 2 for each card discarded. Oh yeah, that's right. But we haven't, don't have much corruption at the moment. Alright. Actually, we will in a sec, won't we? Then we do this. We don't have much corruption, but we have a lot of damage. Oh, we weren't going to do that on the first turn. That's right. Jeez. I don't remember. Well, we'll see how we go. So we'll do that. Do some damage. Uh, choose two to discard. Gain two corruption. Uh, and then we'll get rid of that. And... 20 damage to all. It's not bad. Then we get rid of those two. Do it again. Get rid of one straight away. It's not bad. Inflicting 20 damage. We get 10 automatically. Okay, okay. Uh, Sif 1, discard multiple. Do we want this one straight away? We can definitely do that. We can gain... Three, but then we can't do much else. That's all right. We'll do that. And then we'll take out this guy with some discards. Got another one of these. All right. Oh, we still take damage. I thought we would have stopped that somehow. All right. Unfortunate. Nine, but we get all that back. Except for poison, which is stuffing us up. All right, all right, we've got to start taking them out. Um, it's only at twenty-four percent. This is going to be a hard fight. They got a lot of health. Deal forty damage. Soul strike. What's this? Each time you discard a card, gain one corruption. We don't have that much armor though. Life. Energy. <laughs> I'll get there in the end. Um. No, nah, we'll get rid of that. We'll do one of these. Apply Haunted 2 when attacked with Frenzy 1. Then attack with Frenzy 1. Okay. Alright, I guess we'll just go for the main lady here. Um... We 
still going to take damage. We don't have much block. That's what the problem is with this version. We're going for. We might. We might be losing this one. We do have a lot of corruption now, though. All right, vulnerable, which would be great. Oh, we got we got fear on us. It's a pain. But we can use this, which will do masses of damage. I want to be able to take all of them out at once. 40 block. Mm. Right. Deal 8 damage to a random enemy when purged. And gain block. We should probably do that. Um, we need to draw more. Discard, expel, draw, and discard. Oh man! All right, let's see what else we can find. Let's discard one of these. Okay. Okay. We just discard forever. That's pretty good now. Okay, okay, okay. This is a free 81 attack. Deal 25, 1, 5% corruption damage. Discard 2 for each card discarded. Deal 50% damage to each random, for a random enemy. It's a lot of damage. This will definitely kill this guy with 101. Let's see what we can do here. So if we discard it, it's going to do 91. It's the same thing, realistically. Same, same. But he's dead anyway. Bam. So we can do a lot of damage. We just have to uh, get there. We definitely need to use our uh, special in the second turn so we have energy. We need to gain energy as well. Let's do this guy. A creature who punishes you for playing block cards. This damage, his damage will gain AP from Banes. Okay. Well, we don't play many blocks. So we should be okay here. 23. All right, this is not that strong, but we'll work around it. We'll do it anyway, because we gain the block. Deal 10 damage, discard. It's not that much damage to start with. Let's do this one. Start discarding some cards. Sift 3 might be quite good. Because uh, then we get to get some good block, etc. Discard, gain two corruption. Uh, one corruption. And discard another. Bring a card back up. And discard. Discard. Yeah, we're gaining quite a lot of corruption quite quickly here. Okay. Okay. So then we take a lot of threat, but the next turn we go bonkers, I think. We don't have much energy though, I guess. That's a problem. I should have got rid of that card for sure. Alright, then we go into crazy mode. Uh, we don't want these either. Okay. Now we have a decent amount of damage here. Get rid of that one. Get rid of that one. We do this one. Let's do that one. So it's gaining something back from our hand, from our discard pile. Which. Actually, this might kill him in the end. He's got, he's got a lot of health still, though. 
Actually, we'll get this one back up. We get two back up, but we've got to discard one as well. Well, we'll discard that one. We then get another one back up. Okay. But then we have to discard one again. Man, oh man. All right. Let's get rid of this one. And that one. Let's do this. Or we can uh, make him vulnerable. Um, we'll get, oh, that's rage up, which is pretty good. Let's get rid of this one. And I don't know. This gives us extra, like, multiple attacks. So let's do this one. And that one. All right, let's make him vulnerable for sure. We'll get rid of that one. So he's vulnerable already. Then we do this one. We'll get rid of that one. And then we do that. Not bad. Not bad. And then we... Oh, we'll get the extra rage when we fight the boss. Wow, he put all these things in our deck straight away. Uh, if we use it, we just discard one instant and that's it. But gain one energy. We don't need the energy, we need the block. Oh, 100 health left. Left. Needed to kill him next last turn. We'll have full energy. But we're going to be hit hard. Surviving the last boss is going to be very tricky. Alright. We'll have him this turn, I think. Do that to start with. We'll get rid of that. 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 And that. Alright. Six block discard. So it's just discarding it is better. Okay, but you have to actually discard it. So that, that. We don't need block this turn. We just need to kill him. But we're going to be discarding thousands of things before we can. Alright, done. Oh, no, not done. Done. But we've got half life going into the void. So if we, if we don't release this. I don't know what happens, but I think we need it. So we're going to do it. Alright, here we go. Do we? How many potions do we have? We've only got the one. Apply vulnerable and deal 40 damage. Let's do that. 100%, 100%. So we kill those two lackeys straight away. On the second round. Okay, okay. Get our block up. We will start taking out one now. We discard this because it's the best thing we want to do here. We pick up a card back up. Um, we discard it. Discard that. We haven't got the threshold. We can do a bit of damage. We purge this. Um, I guess we'll just do this. Gain two corruption or block. Just corruption's fine. Okay. And then we've got two energy this turn, which is better than we did last time. Oh gosh, we've just got to survive. Okay. 48 protection. This is the time, damage, the time that we're actually going to attack them. Okay, so we've got nine energy, that's good. So we can block pretty much all of it, can't we? We gotta, we gotta be careful. How many cards do we have to draw? Eight. We only need 18 blocks, so we can do this first. Um... Alright, we've done the block. 
Now we do the baby dragon and this one. We discard stuff to give us angry. Discard another one. I want to vulnerable both of them, if, but I'm not sure if that's going to be too much work. I don't think we want that. So this will... Death Strike is equal to higher than an attack card's energy cost. Triggers plus one. Reduce Death Strike this, by this card's energy cost. Okay. Well, let's start hitting one. So he's going to attack me pretty hard. We want to probably take him out. Alright, we need to bring something back. But we're going to probably discard it at the same time. What is that? Extortion. Ugh. We'll get that back. And maybe this one. Discard that. Then we get something else back. Gaining the energy is the hard thing. I guess... Yeah, we don't have a way to just instantly gain energy. Choose card discard. I guess we'll get rid of that at the moment. We can either discard two or just go for heaps of damage. I think heaps of damage is the way to go here. Oh, he's still alive? Oh, the bastard. He stuffed up all my plans. Alright, well... Oh. Can we get enough cards back? To get back our hit everyone card. Oh, I should have got rid of the other card. Oh, no, I stuffed it. <laughs> Alright, let's grab that. And I don't know what else that. Now we're just discarding one, which will be that one. Because we can gain energy back with these. Okay. Everything's gone except the void now. What is he going to do? Let me soothe you. Heal minge by 10%. Perfect. Oh, okay. I don't know how easy it is to follow all through all this. I probably should move myself as well. Bit late now, Adam, but that's probably a better position for me. Okay. Oh, this is horrid. This is horrid. Void overwhelms. Apply a stun and one daze, then attack. Ow. All right. Well, let's get rid of this. Get rid of that. We'll do 41 damage to him. And that's it. Alright. I only need 15 damage, but we are stunned, whatever that does. Increases energy. Max energy. Okay. All right, let's get this going first. We'll discard this crappy card. We'll get this going. We'll... That's going to that's gonna be really good for us to pick up later, which we can always get later. All right, to get all that going, get some corruption. Oh, we've got 42 already. Um, we need a bit more block. Oh, we may as well use that. We'll use that next turn. I think I want this out of my hand. Okay. That's fine. We can take that damage. We're vulnerable three now, though. Guess what, mate? You're vulnerable two. Okay. We can work with this. Let's do this to him. 
and we've got this as well. We've got tons of damage. Tons of damage. Alright, it's so hard because you've got to discard like everything. Um, make it more, even more vulnerable. We don't have to do that, that's okay. Um... I don't think we need to. Do, we need. To, I don't think we need to think too much because I think he's going to die very, very quickly. Yeah. Okay. Good stuff. Good stuff. The void is conquered again. I was a little bit worried when going into that because of the amount of damage that we took with the other two guys. But there we go. We've got a little friendly ghost here. We can learn a card mastery. Choose a card. Ah, uh, this was a pretty cool one with the upgrade. Death Strike 1, Rage 25, Solith 1. Don't know. The Death Strike's pretty cool. We'll jump on that one. Master the card. There we go, guys. We have completed the run with the Void Mistress. The Lady of the Void. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time. White Falcon out. Vault of the Void.